welcome back everybody you already know that your girl have been sent i want to thank all y'all for fucking with me now this is going to be that same shit different day keep in mind these are daily reads this read will be for whenever you see this motherfucker keep in mind this read is general and it may not resonate with no damn body you see what i'm saying now let me tap right in it's like okay somebody at first was in this energy of celebrating okay happy and having a good motherfucking time and popping bottles around this bitch and living a good life or or having a cake and eat it too or whatever the fuck the case may be but that shit is about to change motherfuckers go from happy to sad around this bitch okay it ain't gonna be nothing left else to celebrate i feel like this is dealing with a situation where somebody is about to lo- it's about to lose someone that someone could be you okay um i feel like this is not a situation where you're gonna lose them you know and oh your world is upside motherfucking down and you stress the fuck out and and you depressed and you don't know what the fuck is going on with your life and you don't even want to live no more no it it ain't gonna be that it's gonna be the opposite okay motherfuckers is gonna be living their life how they should have been in the first place but motherfuckers got caught up in some bullshit okay so you may have got caught up in some shit where have you learned your lesson you know what I'm saying? It's one of these situations. So I feel like this person is about to lose you. They about to lose their world. Okay. Like this person who you could be dealing with. All right. Could have been living in two worlds. Okay. One of the motherfuckers is about to crash the fuck down. All right. Like it ain't even finna be existing anymore. If that shit is making sense, okay? I feel like you was dealing with someone who was just on top of the motherfucking world, but at the same time could have been stressing about this on top of the world. On this, my dreams came true, and what more can I ask for? But it was some type of fear here. You know, somebody was was living in fear surrounding their happiness. It's like, okay, what, 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 what you afraid of? Somebody could have been in a whole nother situation. Okay, somebody had a whole nother person around this bitch. That's why motherfuckers is afraid, scared, you know? So you could have been dealing with someone, could have been in a situation, okay? You met them you two may have fell in love or or whatever the case is you know what i'm saying this person it's like okay i don't know what was going on dealing with the situation that they was in but when shit do go down when you leave this the type of motherfucker that's going to be it's like action you know what i'm saying it's like this motherfucker gonna get into character mode dealing with another motherfucker i don't know if motherfuckers get caught i don't know if it's like okay since you not there they gonna have to try to they're gonna try to put all their energy into this other person like try to make up or, or work on the relationship or it's like enjoy it or something because the the true happiness which is you has left they lost it so they like okay reality kicked in and it's like okay now i gotta pretend now i gotta get in character mode now i gotta take action like now i gotta really because they don't want to lose this one too even though i don't know what the fuck is going on but they they clearly they don't want to lose this because this this could be connected to a marriage or assets or home kids or friends or whatever status or some shit and it's like oh wait 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 i gotta take action i gotta get into character mode 
Because it's like, all right, they lost you. So now they're going to be stressed the fuck out, depressed, sad. So now they got to pretend to be happy with, a, with, with another motherfucker who they was dealing with, who they should have been happy with in the beginning. Now, how this has all kicked off, it's like, okay, a door has opened up for you, an opportunity. Right? You ain't know what the fuck it what really was. You was aware. You could have been aware of what the fuck this was. Okay? But it was kind of confusing. The confusion part came in with communication. Clarity. Asking a question, you're not getting some type of answer. Right? The communication got to the point of... You just may didn't even want to talk to a motherfucker. Like, you probably didn't even want to hear somebody's voice... It was just something that was just a burden dealing with the communication. Okay. So it left you confused. But I feel like you you was aware of who you was dealing with. It could have been an attraction. It could have been just sex. It could have been a spark. Something was there for you to walk through this door. Like you had a choice to back the fuck up. You could have backed the fuck up. Okay. Cut this shit the fuck clean. Cut the knob off of this shit. Don't even let another motherfucker open the door. You know what I'm saying? It's one of these situations. Because of the lies and the cheating and the deception. And 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 you just... It's like, okay, you damn sure can't trust this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? It's one of them type of situations. I feel like your power got exhausted here. It was like, okay, ain't no more tricks in... in you really you done ran out of tricks okay dealing with this shit ain't no more tricks you could do it's like okay what tricks what what other tricks you gonna do where, where um you gonna the situation gonna change or, or you know what i'm saying like it's gonna be something different it's the same shit different fucking day you know what i'm saying it's one of them situations i feel like like even when it came to fulfillment here it took a long time to get that like you had to wait on that. Like the fulfillment part was good when you got it, but it's like, God damn, how long you had to wait to get get it? You know what I'm saying? You really had to have patience around this bitch to 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 really sit there and wait on some type of fulfillment dealing with this situation that you was aware of, but it was confusing. Like, you know what I'm saying? You the type. That you are connected to some powerful fucking energy. I think you know it. But you may be confused on that shit. You may be confused on it. Because I feel like you connected to this energy of success. Like you may not. You may notice like. A lot of shit go your way. Do you notice that? Like a lot of things go your way. Like you connected to that energy where it's like, okay, you could do anything and it'll be successful. I don't give a fuck what it is. It's going to be successful. You connected to this energy of change. Like you can change situations. Like you also connected to this energy of destroying shit. Where it could get ugly. You also connected to this energy where it could end shit for good like some type of lessons here you may find yourself always learning lessons and lessons and less you may be very wise in the spiritual world you also connected to this grounded mother nature like you very connected to the material energy like so you may be very abundant when it comes to material when it comes like it's just something that you you is connected to a lot of energy but you also connected to a energy where it you just it's something going on with your mind where you could be just always can't make a goddamn decision you can't make up your mind like you on that bird box shit you connected to the bird box energy around this bitch. You know what I'm saying? So just know you connected to some powerful fucking energy. You could do some damage. You could do some good. 
but you may just be confused on which which energies to fucking really use if that shit is making sense now dealing with this situation you know what the fuck it is you know what the fuck to do (laughs) period because i feel like at the end of the motherfucking day if you continue to just deal, deal with this shit, you know what I'm saying? You, some people gonna get hurt. You know what I'm saying? Some people gonna get hurt. And I feel like this is a situation where it is best for you to remove yourself now. You know what I'm saying? Before, before the like, before you really do damage here. Before you really do damage. Before you get yourself hurt. You know? For for staying too long and then it'd be too late and now you caught up in this shit. You know what I'm saying? I feel like you've been seen, you've been you've been seen, you've been shown enough here where Okay, motherfuckers is holding on to a situation where the door is is really closed. Like it, it it was it's open, you know, for a motherfucker to go in there. But it, it's closed. Like you be you will be lost. You know what I'm saying? Like once you walk through this door, it it will close. And your ass will be motherfucking lost in this bitch. And it's going to be a lot of dark days. It's going to bring out shit in you that you may have tried to heal in a previous life. Or or it's something that it's like, okay, I done already knew what the fuck it was. I done already got a taste of what the fuck it was the first time. It's like you be once you go in this door, you're gonna be repeating the same shit over and over and over and over. And if you notice, whoever this motherfucker is and whatever the situation is, this could be the type of motherfucker where you keep going back to, or they keep coming back to you, or it's like it's, it's vice versa. It's like one day you don't want to fuck with a motherfucker, here they come. One day motherfucker stop talking to you. Here you come. It's like uh, uh, some shit. Well, motherfuckers don't need to get caught the fuck in. This is just repeating nightmare. At the end of the day. This is some shit that you do not need to learn no more. You should be tired of learning this shit. This is old. This way is old. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody got time for this. This is old. You are wiser. You are stronger. This is the time to leave this shit alone permanently. It's time for a final decision to get the fuck away from this shit. Period. Because this is one of them situations where once you leave, motherfuckers going to be fucked up. But they still going to be dealing with a motherfucker where it's like, okay, to obviously whoever they pretending to be happy with is i guess the one for them you know what i'm saying so yeah that's really all i got thumbs the fuck up if that shit just made sense and uh i see you on the next one peace out y'all